Hey, Gemini. Okay, so these are just general messages. Um, like I told Aquarius, don't come at me if these are not the best messages this week. We are in like, you know, eclipse season. So could get it could look a little rough. We don't know. Um, I am an, a, like an intuitive reader and I just have to say what I say. Okay, so anyway, for Gemini, sun, moon, and rising. And I am even using a different deck, you know, trying, trying my best here to see something for you guys. Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I, Gemini, I'm hearing that you guys are going on a uh, road trip of some sort, or or you have to go somewhere that takes a while. It's like a road trip. Okay. Mm, finding some stability. I like this. I do like this. Tell me more. This is something you've been working on, okay? This is some. This was a goal of yours. Like this, whether it's financial, emotional, doesn't matter. You're finding some stability, and and it's finally here. You know, it's finally on its way. What else for Gemini? Gemini, I'm getting really freaking cold. Um, all of a sudden in your reading, so there's something up. Um. Like, really cold. So, I, I'm going to guess it's sickness, okay? So, be aware of a future sickness. Um, that or you have, like, a, um, a uh, you know, somebody that passed around you or something like that. It's one or the other, but it's definitely something. Okay, for Gemini, sun, moon, and rising. Okay, why is the devil here for Gemini? Mm. I'm still pulling a sickness, Gemini. Jeez, I'm sorry. It doesn't have to be you necessarily. It could be somebody around you. It could be a Capricorn, okay? But this is going to be something uncomfortable for sure. Well, that sucks. Okay. Gemini, sun, moon, and rising. We do have some anxiety here. Something that you wanted to reconcile about is not going to be happening for you. I. Some of you need to look into like energy healing, qigong, something like that, okay? We have you putting some money aside for what? What is that for? We're pulling water and you. You're putting money aside for more than one person, you and somebody else, okay? So maybe you guys have to, you know, start a business together. You're putting some money aside or, you know, you need to um, buy something for the two of you or, I don't know, something. <laughs> Something's going on here. Can you clarify? It could even be a trip. It could even be a separation where you're saving up some money so the two of you can get away from each other. Okay, for Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Oh boy, Gemini, we get some passion here. What's that about? Ooh, it could be a passionate argument, okay? Okay, that's over with, thank God. Um, like some sort of explosive passionate argument, and it does have to do with finances. So um, I don't know if this is at work or at home, but it's it looks feisty. What is the outcome of that for Gemini? The number seven is going to be relevant, okay? Okay, it's going to be one of those things that it, this is going to go, be ongoing for a little bit because it looks like you're just going to, you know, cut them down to size or they do you and then you guys, you know, might say things you regret and then you go hermit mode. 
to cool off or get away something. Gemini. Ooh, yeah, it doesn't go well. It really does not go well. I feel like this is somebody you can't just like get away from though completely, but you are going to you are going to do your best to get away from this situation. What else? <clears throat> Who's this earth sign? Why do I feel like you don't know who this is? I feel like there's an earth sign that's just going to pop up in your energy like very uh, mysterious for some reason I'm getting that okay uh, sure some of you might already know who this is but I'm getting I'm getting the majority of you do not um, they're gonna benefit you in some way Gemini I'm not getting love connection by the way I'm getting like friend or coworker or something like that Tell me more about this situation. Yeah, they're going to help you. I Looks good. Looks fantastic. Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here for Gemini? Somebody has some old coins that are of value. You might not know. Okay, working on your money and your finances and your career, and by the way, it looks much better going forward, especially as we get into um, the, the changes of the seasons, okay? Yeah, I do like it. It looks really good. Gemini. Why is this clarified? All right, somebody, there's a third party situation. I don't know if it's you or somebody else. So this could have happened already, or this is something in your future where there's a third party situation, okay? And again, I'm getting the feeling it's you, but it doesn't have to be. It could literally be somebody you're with or we're with. Why is this coming out now though? you and an earth sign again I'm still getting earth it doesn't have to be guys it could just be somebody who you know has those sort of qualities or it's in their top three but for some of you you are the third party um, and for others of you this person had a third party or has I don't know where you are on the timeline now if you like are single and you're like Kelly none of this makes sense this could be a work situation okay where um, I don't know. I can't, I'm not, I can't even. I don't think it's a work situation, guys. I'm sorry. So it might not resonate with all you, all, all of you Geminis. This could be a very personal reading. Okay, why is the High Priestess in the reverse? We have a lot of water here. Somebody at a distance needing to travel. Could be a Pisces, doesn't have to be. I'm getting cancer as well, so. Tell me more about this for Gemini. Okay, this is good. It's to drop some sort of heavy burden. So this could be somebody traveling towards you or you're traveling towards them. It's sort of like, you know, a coming together. Um, doesn't matter who this person is. Um, a coming together to sort of work things out uh, for, for the both of you, really. Gemini. This person may need finances from you. This could be like anything from like your child to um, a family member to, uh, it looks like they need something from you. Again, maybe they're just traveling towards you to 
see if they can get a job from you, you know, something like that. I don't know why my mouth isn't working today. I'm sorry, guys. I have had plenty of caffeine. But again, I've also been up since midnight, so. For Gemini. Okay, something being exposed. Somebody definitely has a cancer sign in their energy. Something being exposed. The truth coming out. It's very, it's going to be very hard to hear and deal with. I'm seeing a ballerina. Somebody's holding back their, um, somebody's holding back their true intentions. I still think, you know, some of you guys, if you believe in it, have a spirit watching you or around you because I'm seeing a spirit in this card as well. Um, it looks like you are also like nostalgic for like, um, somebody you miss. You know, or like your 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 brain keeps thinking about them, maybe even at night. For Gemini. Yeah. Could have been somebody you were in a long term commitment with, even marriage. Something if you're married, I, I do not wanna tell you this, Gemini, but it looks like there's a divorce coming. <clears throat> If you're in a long-term commitment, it looks like it's coming to an end as well. Son of a beach. Not taking that card. Gemini. Yeah, that's rough, Gemini. Okay. I feel like as some sort of last resort, you or somebody else is going to sort of like, uh, like truly expose yourself, meaning, you know, letting your guard down completely, being willing to put in more effort, trying to like, almost like this desperation, um, but I still don't see it working out. a long process it does look like a partnership I, I, of course it could be a business partnership but it really isn't coming out that way Gemini okay it looks like a love connection could be an Aries doesn't have to be both of you are very upset the letter E is going to be significant we do have some sort of judgment If, again, you're going through some sort of divorce, you're going to be okay. If you are going through some sort of, like, um, business partnership where that is falling apart, you're going to be okay. Um, if you are, the number six will be relevant. If you are yeah, that's, that's what, that's it. That's it. You're going to be okay, basically, okay? There's some sort of judgment here. You'll be all right. Heavy on the fire sign over here. Why is the Ace of Cups in the reverse? I feel like the fire sign is you because you're sort of, like, transitioning um, from, you know, being a little bit passive and trying to work something out and trying to, like, be the bigger person and then... You're just like fed up, you know, the rage is, is there. You want some sort of something new. You want something new to transpire. You want, you want like a fresh start. Okay. And maybe that's what's happening. Maybe you're, you're developing like this, this new personality or, you know, temporary personality that is ready to just like knock people over. Me too, girl. Okay, it's gonna take some time. This is a slow transition. For Gemini. Why is the Two of Cups here? You know, guys, I have a really hard time keeping my mouth shut. Like, I really do. Like, I just. Like, I, I vomit words sometimes, my friends will tell you. Um, but I'm seeing somebody with a heart on. So, 
take it as it resonates. Um, it, the Two of Cups comes with the Two of Swords. So there is some decision making you'll need to make probably in the future between two people, okay? One of them is like more like destined to be with you. The other one I think is more of like a sexual tension sort of thing. The towers here, why is that? You're gonna have a hard time deciding. The options will be great. What else does Gemini need to know? Yeah, you might hold back though when you're meeting new people because you're like, yeah, I'm not going to get burned again. I know how this goes. Lots of options though with new people if you're looking. If you're not looking, these could just be options with new friends and, you know, uh, it doesn't look work related to be honest with you, but it could be new clients as well. Why is the Five of Swords here? Something from the past being brought back up. Could be a fellow air sign, but not necessarily. Somebody who did not apologize or tell you the truth. Yeah. This is actually in your best interest, Gemini. It's not, it's not, it looks bad, but it's actually not because it's going to kind of push you to be better, do better, and feel better. Okay, take better care of yourself, your mental health, your stability. Um, hopefully, yeah, money, money in the future looks okay as well, but it does look like you're going to spend some time, like, so again, if you, <clears throat> when the time comes that you're like, you know, I really have to focus on my health, or I really have to focus on um, my mental health or like taking better care of myself. It is similar to Aquarius, it's going to cost you um, quite a bit of money. You know, it's going to be, you know, expensive supplements or expensive food or, you know, um, an expensive hobby of some sort. So just be mindful, like don't go overboard there. We do have change coming, um, Scorpio energy. So let's just take a look at that before we shut it down here for Gemini. What is this change for Gemini? Gemini, it looks like you're putting on a whole new mask. Like, like you are truly changing. You're just like, all right, I am so done with the old me. What is this? It's new people. It's new people. Be careful of these new people wanting something more from you than just your attention, okay? whether that's finance or it looks financial. Just be careful. If it's clients, I I don't love them. I don't love them. Be really choosy in the future who you associate with. Somebody's feeling emotionally distant. Somebody is missing you. Somebody is missing you, Gemini. It looks like a water sign doesn't have to be. Um, you know, it doesn't look like this person failed you horribly, just an FYI. This could just be somebody like, this could be your kid for all I know. Anything else? I'm going to end it here for Gemini. Fixing something in your workplace. And I see a sickness again. Yeah. Fixing something in your workplace. So whether that's like you're like physically fixing something, you know, um, I, I think you should, that like stability card really is for you. It just flew out. Um, so fixing something in the workplace or like fixing something. So, you know, uh, maybe a paper that was written incorrectly or um, a client that's upset and you have to like go and resolve it. Okay. All right, Gemini. Well, I hope you have a great week and I hope this helps.